Uh, hi guys, this is Shobit and in this video we will discuss how to create a docker image of .NET Core project and after that we will push this image into the Azure container registry. So here you can see that I have already opened the Microsoft Azure portal and here we can create a container registry. So for creating a container registry you just need to click on plus icon over here. So once you click on that you just need to fill a form, a basic form. So it basically asks for the resource group, which resource group you want to create. After that you have to give a name and after that you need to specify the type of SKU, for example basic or standard or premium. So since uh, I have already created a repository, so I am not creating a new one. So this is a very simple step you can create from yourself. Okay. So this is the repository which I have created. So I'll just go into the code first and after that I will show you what is this, right? So for the .NET Core, I just need to create a new project. So what I'll do, I'll just go into the project over here and I will go for ASP.NET Core Web API project and uh, I just go with the next one. So I'll say demo approach image and uh, next so here i have to select this enable docker so after that i need to click on create so it will create a project for me so what i need to do i just need to open the folder structure so open folder in file explorer i need to open this folder i need to just copy this docker file and put it into the root directory right paste it over here Okay, fine so now what I need to do I need to go to the command prompt so here I am going command prompt so I need to create a image of this project so for that I, we have a command the command is docker build and dot dot means and uh, the docker file should be in the current directory I just need to press enter it will take some time to fetch and will create the image okay in the meantime i will come back over here in the container registry so this is the container registry you can see over here and here and you can see we have this login server detail over here we want that and uh, further if you want for username and password of this uh, repository you just need to click on access key here you will see all the details what should be the uh, registry name what should be the login server and the username and the the username and the password right so it is here so for the demo purpose i have created that so after that i will just remove it and uh, here in the repository right so here in the repository you will see uh, we have lots of images so prior to that demo i have created and push one images now i will push another image okay so that's all about the repository in the Azure. So let me quickly go back to the, yeah. So here you can see that everything is done. Image has been created. So I just need to figure it out the name of the image. So the command of that is Docker images. So here you can see that there are lots of, com lots of images there. So here the name of my image is demo proj image, right? I just need to copy it and uh, I just need uh, so before pushing this image to Azure uh, container registry I need uh, to tag this image right so for the tagging purpose we have a command docker tag and the name of the name of the image and after that we need to specify the tag this is the tag and after that space I just need to copy the URI of this server. So this is the URI, you just need to copy over here and slash and again the complete name of this file. So once I do that, so you can see over here this command has been done and now when I see this docker images, so you can see over here. Uh, this is the docker show bit demo dot this is the docker image the previous one and this is the current one which I have uh, which I did just right away right 
so this is the thing and uh, now what i need to do i just need to push this right so i just need to push this so what i have to do i just need to copy this and uh, docker push and uh, after that we have to enter so here uh, so this is saying that the push refers to the repository tag does not exist right so i have to specify a tag so now you can see that it's preparing for push and uh, it will take uh, maybe five or ten seconds after that it will push to the docker container registry so it's just basically digest and the so it seems everything is done so i just need to refresh the repository and over here you can see my demo proj image is there okay one more thing uh, before suppose if you are a first time user so you want you have to log in into this docker registry so it's for the login purpose what you need to do you just need to go with this command docker login and the uri uh, the uri of this repository which you will get from the access key so this is the uri basically you want and uh, it will basically ask for the authentication if uh, if you are a very first time then you need to put username and password since i have already logged in so everything is done with me so login succeed is already there but if you try with the first time you have to put username and password you can get the username and password from here so this way you can see that we already created a, a, a docker image and push it into the repository that's all from my side if you have any question concern just uh, uh, put comment on the video or maybe you can email me thank you